guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Sonia for those of you stopping by for the very first time. This is my home channel. If you're not familiar, I also have a DIY and cooking channel. But I thought today, since last week was full of cleaning inspiration, uh, make sure you check out those videos. I think I posted three. And this week, I thought today I share with you um, some uh, haul that I have picked up from Dollar Tree and Dollarama. I live in Ontario, Canada, so we have Dollarama, and I t our Dollarama tends to be a touch more better stocked than Dollar Tree. Our Dollar Tree isn't the greatest. I'm not sure whether it's just uh, the people that own it or whether it's just the Canadian Dollar Tree. I'm not all that sure why, but occasionally I do luck out and find things um, that are neat, but most of the time it's just a really big mess. So I'm gonna start with Dollarama. Now there's a lot of, I thought it would be okay to share here because even though some of it are, some of it is decor, some of our just home things, uh, and some of our, some are supplies, my DIY supplies, but I thought it was appropriate to share it on this channel since I will be creating these DIYs to showcase on the decor that I will be doing for fall on this channel. So without further ado, let's get started. So I'm gonna start with Dollarama first, and I got a bag full here, and um, I've got this leaf. Now I'm. I saw that Dollar Tree had these as well. At Dollarama, they were the same price as Dollar Tree, dollar twenty-five. Now these are great for um, coasters. I sometimes put them together and um, use them as a table runner. But uh, I think this one I will try and do a DIY with. If not, I will use it as a placemat. And then I picked up the this one, Grateful Thank for a Blessed Pumpkin. I will most likely DIY this one, but if you like all the little shine, the sparkly things and the, what is this, a mauve color, I would say, uh, then you might want to use this in your fall decor as well. And this was $1.25 as well. Now they also have these signs, which I thought they were really, really nice. And they were um, $2, but if you didn't wanna use them as they are, these can pop off. As you can see, they're kinda like 3D, and you can use them all separate. I'm not sure how I'm gonna use it. I really, really like this one, but I really like these pumpkins on this one, so we'll see. And like I said, they were $2. Uh, then I picked up some more of these paintbrushes. I'm really bad at washing my paintbrushes after I use them. So I'm always buying new. I know it's kind of a waste of money. And I picked up the bamboo serving paddle. These are great for home decor. If you want to layer your cutting boards or anything like that on your stove, I love how that looks. Uh, I'm not sure whether I'm going to DIY with this one or use it as home decor either. So, But they don't often have these. It's a hit and miss. I was actually looking for a pizza um, um, board, but they didn't have it. But they had these, so I picked up this one just in case if I need it next time and they didn't have it. And this was $4. And I love the little kitchen towels. These are $2, but these are really good and they absorb quite well and they're kind of farmhousey, so I really like them and for 2 bucks you can't go wrong. But some of the ones that I get, especially seasonal ones when they have them, they they don't absorb nothing. So they're more for decor than anything else. And then I like these artist panels because I use them for my DIYs often and I have plenty coming for fall. So I needed to pick up these. Um, oh. I have picked up some other things and I just remember I left them in a car. I also picked up a white, wipe down white foam board and that one is um, from Dollarama for I think they're $1.25 as well. 
and I will be creating a DIY with that one and I also picked up an artist actual artist uh, the it's not a panel it's um uh, easel I think I forget what they're called but with the white on it so it looks like this but it has the white material on it and I picked that up as well for some DIYs and then I just have some toys that I picked up for daycare that's uh, just gonna stay there and then I'm going to share because I remembered it's in a car and my son just took the car to work so I don't have that here so at Dollar Tree I had picked up the frame that I will be using to create a wreath out of for fall and then they had these pumpkins which are great for DIYs or you can even just use them like this um, depending on your style of uh, in your home and then I picked up a wreath form the willow wreath form uh, for my little home sign that I created because I will be creating a fall wreath for my home sign and then I picked up this one now the one difference between this one and the leaf one from Dollarama is this one is significantly thinner material than the other one and it's the same price uh, they also had the leaf one at Dollar Tree but they are quite a bit thinner I don't know if you can actually see that but the difference between the two so there is quite a bit of difference in the thickness And then I had picked up some of these pumpkins. Now I will be DIYing with these for sure because I'm not a huge fan of the way they all this looks together. I will set, I will most likely take, take these sunflowers off and use them for a different DIY, maybe for creating my home wreath. But on top of the pumpkin, I'm not crazy about it. So, so these two are this. Well, this one's a little bit bigger than this one, and then they have different flowers, as you can see. And then this one is completely a lot shorter and more fatter, and then it has a different flower as well. And then I have picked up the metal words. These are the Thankful Harvest, Harvest and Welcome. I did some DIYs last year with these and I love using these and then I just picked up a small cake pan that I needed well that's it I hope you guys enjoyed so everything at Dollar Tree before I forget is dollar 25 in Canada not dollar just because I think the conversion so but um, I hope you enjoyed this short sweet haul uh, I can't wait to share all my fall uh, stuff that's coming up your way and I will be having fall cleaning uh, starting in September it will be I did this last year on my uh, DIY channel well it was called domestic diva 76 but now it has separated into three different channels so if you are not familiar with them I have a DIY channel cooking channel and a home channel so last year I was uh, doing fall cleaning it was I cleaned I have a list that I follow I have a blog that I share my list on it so I will be doing that in fall as well and if you want to clean along with me make sure you follow the list that I will be posting in the in my videos it won't be a challenge or anything like that I will just be cleaning and if anybody else wants to clean along you can go ahead and clean your house with me and I will be doing a lot of decorating for fall. So if you're not subscribed, you might want to press the subscribe button because there's a lot of fall fun coming your way. And after fall is Christmas and I love Christmas. Uh, if you haven't seen my Christmas in July, last year's uh, home tour, make sure you check it out um, because I do have four full-size Christmas trees that are themed differently. So you might want to check that out. So make sure you're uh, subscribe and your notification bell is on and I can't wait to see you in my next video. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching.